Okay, hi, this is my first tutorial on Microsoft Small Basic. Um, if you haven't installed Small Basic yet, you can get it from for free from uh, smallbasic.com. Uh, you can see there the uh, download button. Another thing that's a very good idea to get hold of while you're there is um, to have a look at this tutorial, freely available, which uh, will help you to start to learn how to program as well. So um, you can click on that link to find it. Okay. Um, when you've installed it, when you double click on Small Basic, you'll get a thing looks something like this uh, with an untitled new file there. What we're going to do is straight away we'll save that. So I'm going to save it in this folder here. I'm actually going to save it over this one because uh, that's pretty much the same as what I just wanted. Uh, I just wanted to start again with the same idea. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is a very simple program, which usually is what you start with when you're writing, a, uh, learning a new language. Um, I'm going to call it hello. Sb. Well, it is called that, um, and it's a hello world program. So basically, the first thing you usually do when you're learning a new language is to print hello world to the screen. Um, by the way, this is a comment line. So a line that begins with a apostrophe like that um, is a comment. It's ignored by the computer when it's run. And the idea is that comments make your code a lot more readable to yourself or anybody else who's coming along later to try and see what you were doing, especially if something gone wrong. Now I'm starting to write in a command now. And the command I wanted to look for is uh, something to do with a text window. And you'll notice that as I started typing there, uh, it started to suggest me some uh, options. This is called the IntelliSense uh, part of the environment and if I want to, uh, as soon as I've got the correct command on the IntelliSense uh, wheel there, if I press enter it'll, it'll automatically choose that command. So I want to do text window dot right line hello world. You'll notice that I'm putting quote marks around what I want to be printed out and brackets uh, around that whole thing. And the right line, text window right line means it's going to open up a text window just like a console really. If you're familiar with that from other other oops um, from other programming stuff um, and it's going to write hello world. So there it is, hello world, press any key to continue. So that's our very first program uh, in Small Basic. Okay, I'm just going to stop this video now because uh, I had a little problem with the last one I made and check everything's working, but uh, I'll be back with another one very soon.